What's up you guys? I cannot believe I am actually filming this video right now because a couple weeks ago I did a Q&A on my Instagram story and one of the questions I answered asked if James and I had any plans to get another dog. And my answer was basically like, yes, we do want to get another dog at some point, but we don't have any time frame or any set plans. And I said, it could be next month, it could be a year from now, who knows. And here we are today, it's next month and we have a puppy. So I'm gonna show you guys some footage from when James and I first picked him up and also some footage of him exploring our apartment for the very first time. We just picked up our new puppy, our new little baby Corgi. Are you excited? Yeah. He's in the back there. He just stopped crying. He's been whining a little bit, but oh, there he goes. Oh. Hey baby, this is your new home. Hi. Oh, hi. Are you the cutest little thing ever? Oh my god, look at that bum. Hi little guy. This is your new home. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Let's go to the pee pad. He'll probably take off his collar. You missed the pad for your pee, but then you pooped on it. So that was pretty good. <laughs> oh, that is like ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> oh, could anything be cuter than a corgi? Like, honestly. <laughs> like, ridiculous. He looks like an adult already. No. <laughs> right size. Look at that. I rolled over all by myself, Mom and Dad. You're too big. Myself. All by myself without Grandma even helping me. <laughs> Lots of personality, eh? Oh my gosh. Oh, jump. Jump down. So this is Kovu. Hi, buddy. First things first. Yes, I did make him an Instagram account. It is at Kovu Corgi. It will be linked down below. Make sure you guys go follow him because I have kept this a secret for the past few days. And so in order to contain myself from just telling everyone, I've already been posting photos of him over there. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. Yes, his name is Kovu. It is from The Lion King 2. We have also been calling him Coco. That's kind of his main nickname, Little Baby Cocos. Also, if you aren't following me on Instagram already, I'll link my Instagram down below. It's at Sari Rihanna because I'm definitely going to be posting him on my stories constantly from now on. It'll probably be mostly photos on his account for now. But he is 12 weeks old and he is a Pembroke Welsh Corgi. He is going to be, or he is, a red-headed tricolor. So basically what that means is that most if not all of the black on his head will actually kind of shed as he loses his puppy coat and so his head <laughs> and his ears and everything will be red but yeah this is him he's gonna look like a totally different dog probably in a few months because of that oh look at you i'm gonna sit him down for a sec so this is our fourth day with him and a little bit about him he is so incredibly sweet. He's just like super floppy and mellow. We think he's going to end up being very cuddly. We're really, really hoping he's going to be a big cuddler because having a snuggly dog is literally just the best thing in the world. He's also constantly making little baby puppy sounds, like little grunts and squeaks, and it is the cutest thing ever. So yesterday evening, we also introduced Kovu to Willow. For those of you who don't follow me on social media, Willow is my mom's whippet and we love her to bits. She has so much personality and she's absolutely crazy. So we introduced them after she had spent the day at daycare while my mom was working. So we knew she'd be like a little bit more tired and mellowed out. So I'm going to insert some of that footage now of Kovu and Willow, future best friends, meeting each other for the very first time. Oh, look at him looking. And she knew best friends is. Oh, here's <laughs> he's, he's thinking about coming out. She looked at him. I know. I don't think she knows he's real. Hilarious. <laughs> Wait a minute. Ooh. Oh, James is home. Hi, James. Uh, I they're, just walked in the door. They're just meeting. They're just meeting for the very first second. Oh, Kobe's a bit scared. Yeah, he's gonna be a little nervous. Who's that? Oh, little tail. Who's that? Okay, I'm done checking out. 
He says, wait a minute, come back. Look at Coco. Oh, he's so little. Oh, hey, Coco. Hey, oh my gosh. <laughs> she just finished eight hours of daycare. A little kisser. Yeah. Well, says, I'll kiss you. Look, his ears are back. He's so cute. He's like, wait a minute, it's coming here. Mom. <laughs> oh, hi. Who's that? He's like, how did you get up on the couch? <laughs> oh, look, did you do oh. Oh. Oh, 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 the play thing. That's so good. A little bit of fish. <laughs> no, you too. Oh, look at his big fat. Who's see him? His paws are so much bigger than Marlo's like, paws. Like, <laughs> look at her down low. There we go. Look at it. She's like, I'm no threat. I'm just a small corgi too, see? That's look how good he's yeah. being. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, see, she's getting the idea that she wants to play. Bamboozled. He'll learn those little social cues, hey? What is this thing? Is she staying? Do we have another one? Do I have to share my food? Good girl. Oh, come on. Kisses. Oh, kisses. Did you spend the day at daycare? And she never ate breakfast before <laughs> she went. And she will have run. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're going to be best friends. We're going to go for walks together. And sometimes car rides. <laughs> and sometimes we're gonna eat treats together. <laughs> and sometimes this old guy's gonna come to grandma's house. Oh, look, sorry, look, look, he's crawling onto me. Oh. Yeah, I just wanted to film this quick little video introducing him. That's another thing too. He is also already following me everywhere, and we are just in love with him so I just wanted to post this quick video introducing him I didn't really have any other videos planned for this week because I have obviously been really busy with him and he is going to be a huge part of my life for years and years now for those of you who don't know in March our senior corgi Tigger who we adopted a day before his 10th birthday passed away and then two months after that, my chinchilla periwinkle, which if you know periwinkle, then you've been subscribed to me for a very long time. I had him for 10 years and he passed away very suddenly at the end of May. It's like one of the only times I've really had to say both of those things out loud. Just been a rough year in that regard as I have mentioned in other videos and I'm just so happy. <laughs> now I'm crying. <laughs> But I'm just so happy to have a dog again and I'm so in love with him. He is my new best friend and our house just isn't complete without a dog. There's nothing better than having a dog. Look at this little peanut. Look at this little peanut. Oh my goodness. Look at that happy face. Look at that happy face. We have to carry him down the stairs and through the halls. One for, you know, health reasons because he doesn't have all of his vaccinations yet because he's too young. And also housebreaking and everything. I don't want him to pee in the hall. So we spend a lot of time like this. Usually I put my hair up though. And I also take off my earrings for obvious reasons. Okay, interrupting myself quickly because I'm editing this video and I realized I forgot to mention one of the most important things because I know I'm going to get questions or concerns about this. As some of you may know, we are going on a trip at the end of September. September. Is this the most ideal timing? Obviously not, but before we could even think of getting Kovu and really consider it strongly, obviously we had to make sure we had plans and the best possible situation we could possibly have given the circumstances. So I just want to add, don't worry about that. He's going to be in very good hands while we are gone. We have found the best possible solution where he's not going to be super stressed out or anything like that so I just wanted to throw that in there it is absolutely going to kill me to leave him and I keep saying I've been looking forward to this trip for the better part of this year and now I'm like not even going to want to go because I have to leave my beautiful puppy but yeah I hope you guys have enjoyed meeting our new baby Kovu and I hope you guys love him as much as we do Yes, oh my goodness. And I'm sorry if parts of this video have been out of focus. I had to film this on my vlog camera since I knew he would be squirming. Oh, okay. But yeah, that's where I'm going to wrap up this video. Once again, go follow him at Kovu Corgi and follow me at Sari Rihanna. Links to both of the accounts will be down below if you want to see more of him. And if there are any cute little videos you guys want to see with him here, definitely let me know. Like, I know a lot of people have been doing like 
feeding their dogs different like fruits and veggies and stuff like that. I think that would be really fun to do with him when he's a little bit older. So yeah, let me know if there's anything you want to see. And I'm just, I'm so happy you guys. I've had such a good week. I tweeted earlier that my heart is so full and it really is. But yeah, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed seeing our new baby Kobu. You love puppies, you love corgis, you're happy for me, <laughs> anything like that. And subscribe down below if you are new. And that is going to be it for today's video.